If you guys haven't already, be sure to smash the subscribe button and of course click on the notification bell to be notified when my new videos are out. Been noticing a lot of you guys who watch my videos aren't subscribed and even if you are subscribed you haven't clicked on that bell icon yet so please be sure to do that. And we're starting something brand new on the channel. Post a positive comment following with your IGN, smash the like button on the video, and be sure to be subscribed and click on the bell icon and I'll be choosing 5 to 10 people per video to be invited to my amazing Minecraft Pocket Edition realm. Anyways, Let's get straight to this video. Wait, is that the shipwreck? Is that the yes? Yo, yo, we found the shipwreck. Nice. Yo, finally. What is up, guys? It is your boy Patar, and in today's video, we're gonna show you guys how to find shipwrecks, buried treasures, and of course, last but not least coral reef now if you guys don't know what these are these were just recently added into the aquatic update and um you could just tell by experience if you guys watch my videos or other youtuber videos that these are not easy to find so um yeah i'm gonna be completely honest i did not find this this is an actual seed so if you guys want to test out this seed you can feel free to check the description below and i don't know if it works for the latest version of minecraft pocket edition because they just added the experimental features which is awesome but i don't know if you put this seed and you enable experimental features that it's gonna work so just in case to make sure that this baby does work i am on the beta version of minecraft pocket edition and all the coordinates and all the things slash tp xyd all that to the shipwreck and the coral reef and of course last but not least the buried treasure will be in the description below with the link to the article that i got on so huge shout out to this guy man you don't understand how long it would take him to find each and every one of those things a lot of grinding but it pays off but let's set a like go for six likes guys that is the most amount of likes i ever asked for in a video so six likes is appreciated i know we can do it you guys have been showing a lot of support show that support in today's video but hopefully guys enjoy this awesome minecraft pocket edition video let's get straight into it so first things first we're just gonna create a brand new world because this is the c let's actually open up my phone so i can just you know make sure that i didn't get the seed incorrect um so we're gonna just create a brand new world create new um and make sure you aren't creative um and cheats is enabled because you're gonna die obviously or if you want to find this um you're gonna just make sure and just in creative whatever we're just gonna name this baby like aquatic because you know we're gonna be finding all the aquatic features which i've been trying to find for ages but today that all changes we're gonna just look at each each and every one of them multiplayer is off um and of course oh i almost forgot we have to put the seed so like i said the seed will be in the description or you guys could just you know pause this video and type in the seed let me just type it in give me one second guys so this is the seed 184 899 69 Five, two. So make sure you do get that C. Just copy of uh, just copy and paste into Minecraft Pocket Edition and it should be all set to go. But make sure that this seed is right. And uh we can just obviously make sure that um experimental gameplay, of course, we have to make sure that baby is on because without that, we're not gonna have a lot of the features. Let's scroll down, make sure that we have everything okay. Everything is a okay, and let's just create the world and see this baby in action. All right, and you should be spawning somewhere around here. And Oh, this world is looking beautiful, but we came here to see the coral reef, the shipwreck, and of course, last but not least, the buried treasure. So all the, you know, the TP, the, all the coordinates will be in the description below. Be sure to check it out. It'll be labeled and all that. Don't worry, guys. I got you. All right, let's see which one we're going to do. We're going to do, let's do coral reef first, and we're going to save the best for last, which is the shipwreck. So we're going to do coral reef, and then, of course, the buried treasure, which has crazy loot, I heard. And of course, last but not least, the shipwreck wreck so let's just get this tp coordinates let's go slash right here um we're just gonna put slash tp and then we're gonna put the coordinates make sure you do put it correctly i'm gonna show you guys exactly how to put it correctly so slash tp um and i'm pretty sure it's like a yep negative um three nine four one just like this guy so don't worry i got you so negative three nine four one seventy and of course the last one is i'm pretty sure it is negative three yeah three five um eight eight there we go and when we tp we are gonna tp straight into to the coral reef in three two one and there we go we should be at the coral reef and oh oh, oh whoa 
what the heck is going on all right i think we should be here i'm just gonna make sure that these coordinates is perfectly fine so i'm just gonna make sure i'm gonna look at it um look at that and it's not exact but it should be perfectly fine and let's see if it, is that the coral reef yo this is the coral reef guys this is my first time ever seeing this naturally spawned in without me spawning it um let's actually get ourselves some glowstone and look at this baby all right we got ourselves the glowstone let's keep on going underground right here and yes this is a coral reef so if you guys want to see a coral reef and some dead coral here and there feel free to type in that exact coordinate it will be in the description below so don't worry guys place a little bit more and this is just my first time ever seeing a coral reef just like spawn in naturally um i've never seen it or oh, i saw the block but i just never seen it spawn in naturally so that's pretty cool we got some dead coral here and there and it doesn't look bad to say for myself i don't know if you can use these to like make stuff here and there but if you can guys please be sure to let me know in the comment section below. So not bad. So that's the coral reef. Let's go up and let's spawn into the buried treasure, guys. That is the second to last we're going to be seeing in this awesome aquatic update. All right. So slash TP, same command. Um, So slash TP negative 3, 3,784. So there we go. 7,784. Um, there we go. 70. And um, I'm pretty sure it's 3688. So these are not really far apart, but... This should bring us to the buried treasure. We're going to spawn in in three, two, one, and boom. I think we should be there. And okay, ooh, we're going to have a little lag as usual. And this is the cord. Now, in the picture, he is next to some sand thing. I'm pretty sure he broke it, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, but let's just break some sand here and there. Because in the picture, he does, it looks like it's right next to some sand. So let's just break this and see if we can find ourselves the buried treasure. Let's actually use a little TNT to see if we can find it you know, a little bit quicker. Got ourselves the TNT, got ourselves the flight and steel. And I'm hoping that we don't break this chest. But all right, yeah, it does look like it is on land, somewhere near land. Uh, we're going to break right here as well because in the picture, it does look like it's somewhere around here tnt there we go play a little, little bit more there we go we're gonna blow up and hopefully we can find this buried treasure guys seems that it's somewhere near here it's some stone here and there is some um little let's see some sand it's kind of weird i don't think we're gonna find it but let me just keep on searching guys because i know we're gonna find it hopefully finally guys like what the heck it was literally right below me so if you guys spawn in the coordinates all you have to do is just dr dig straight below and you'll find a chest but we found it, guys. Let's see what's in the chest. And Ooh, so we got ourselves potion of regeneration. We got ourselves some chain here and there. Three chain boots. What the heck? A little bit weird. They should have randomized it a little bit more, but it's okay. This is just automatic. Um, we do have ourselves three iron and um, two gold. So that's not bad. The only best thing that, you know, that take a while to get is the potion of regeneration it does uh, it only lasts like 45 seconds so hey that is not bad to say for myself one thing you should know guys is that these buried treasures does not spawn underwater it actually spawns in the surface near some you know um some sand and some stone so that's a little advice to just to let you guys know and last but not least is the shipwreck and i'm gonna show you guys exactly i went to create him for survival because i just want to make sure that i didn't you know break anything i was like is that the chest holy crap it is and then i just went to creative um but all right let's Let's go into slash tp um okay so slash tp and these are the coordinates let me put it give me one second guys negative one eight eight zero ninety eight and nine hundred and fifty two so this is the exact coordinates of course like i said it will be in the description below but are you guys ready for the shipwreck i don't think you are <laughs> three two one and let's teleport to the shipwreck which i've never found in my life oh saw my life in front of my face so hopefully we can find it and it is getting a little bit late so let's put it in daytime there we go time set day and it should be directly underneath us let's see if it is and oh, we need to get ourselves some glowstone give me one second there we go we got the glowstone and this is the moment of truth let's go and let's see if we can find it and oh whoa Okay, I was like, what the heck is that? Let's keep on going. Let's keep on going. Oh, we're going really deep. Holy crap. This is super deep. Hopefully, we find it. Holy crap. You guys can't see crap. Okay, let's place the glowstone right here. I can't see anything at all. Wait, is that the shipwreck? Is that the shipwreck? Yo, yo, we 
found the shipwreck nice yo finally first time i've ever saw a shipwreck in my life this was very very deep I don't even know if you guys can see. Um, I'm just gonna drink some night vision potion because it does make you see a little bit better. Let's drink this baby up and there we go. So you can see a little bit better and this is the shipwreck. This is the first time I've ever seen it and I didn't think it was this deep. But if you guys are playing survival and you want to find a shipwreck, you gotta go really, really deep. But uh, okay, we got ourselves a little door right here. Um, pretty cool. Let's see. There's a chest here. What is this? This is a. Uh, I thought that was a pressure plate or something. I thought it was gonna be a little troll. All right, let's see what else is over here. I don't know if this is a chest, cause there's no way you're gonna find a shipwreck, and it's not gonna be some good loot here. So let's see if we can find ourselves a chest. All right, bad news. We can't find ourselves some chest, but I'm looking. I'm looking. Give me one second. They want to just add a shipwreck for no reason. They have. There has to be some good loot here. All right, let's start breaking the shipwreck. Um, hopefully we can find ourselves some good loot. Uh, all right, let's start breaking it. I don't want to break it, but we got to find ourselves some loot. I don't know if there's loot in here, but you want to find a shipwreck and not find any loot. I mean, come on, come on. Come on, we keep on breaking, and we can't find ourselves any loot. So I don't know if loot spawned in shipwreck, but it should. Um, But there's no loot in this shipwreck, guys, unfortunately. But hey, the good part is that we did find ourselves a shipwreck. That's a first. Of course, not legit. We had to use a seed, but it's better than nothing. This doesn't look too bad to save for myself. But if you guys want to find the coordinates and straight to these, and of course the seed, all of that will be labeled and of course organized in the description below just for you guys. And of course, the article that I found is baby huge. Shout out to the developer, man. You don't understand how long, how much journeys, how much breaking he has done to find the seed for you guys. So feel free to check it out if you guys have the beta to find the shipwreck and look how how deep we were guys but you can see it here look at that it's, it's pretty it's pretty clear because we have night vision but a little advice as well if you guys want to find yourself a shipwreck or some coral reefs night vision is the perfect baby for you but hopefully guys enjoyed this amazing minecraft pocket edition video but thank you guys for watching this video if you guys enjoyed this video be sure to give it a like guys this seat is awesome and like i said huge shout out to the developer do you know how much like grinding or just how much nights he had to stay up just to find each of these babies especially you know the shipwreck wasn't really as hard to find um what is it the coral reef wasn't really as hard to find but the treasure chest was very hard to find you had to literally break sand to find that baby so i'm just gonna be you know straight honest the treasure chest is probably the hardest thing to find but huge shout out to the developer i don't know his name I forgot his name, but huge, huge shout out to you, bro. Keep up the good word. But thank you guys for watching this video. Pat's RHD. I will see you guys in the next one. Peace. Out.